What's up guys, it's your boy Wolfie, welcome back to another Draft of Glory video. Now, as you probably know by now, the ultimate team of the season has been released by EA. It's got the best team of the seasons that have been featured uh, in this year's FIFA 19. However, in my opinion, I feel like they messed up a little bit with some of the players they've put into the team. They've missed out the likes of Neymar, uh, they missed out team of the season Hazard, they missed out um, Salah. Just some few big names. They got some really high ratings and then they added in some players that kind of have some lower ratings which doesn't make much sense. But anyway, we're going to get straight into a draft today. Hopefully we can get um, some good players and a great team and then hopefully win it. But let's get straight into it. Today I want to make some a team that has some incredible team of the seasons. Hopefully we can make like a full team of the season team. Um, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully we can go far as well and not get hit by the semi-final curse which I keep getting hit with at the moment which is very annoying. Now the formations I've been given here are pretty tragic. I'm not going to lie. Two really dead 4-4-4-1-1s four, 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 one, or 4-1-4-1. Four, one, four, one. Uh, we've got five at the back and three at the back. So here I'm going to go 4-4-2. Four, four, um, I quite like using it at the moment to be fair. Let's see who our captains are. Oh, not great. I did say I want to do a full team in season team, but I would much rather use JJ Okocha here than uh, Paredes. He's 78 pace as a striker. That is just not going to fly with me. Um, who do we get in our first striker position? Ooh, okay. We get 94 Suarez. We get a uh, hero Lucas, I think. That was when he won against Ajax or scored a hat trick. Gary Zeus, Rashford, and team of the season, uh, Tammy Ab uh, Abraham. He looks okay, although I think here I'm going to go Suarez because he's, uh, Abraham's just going to be really hard to link. I feel like I'm just going to scrap that idea of getting a full team of the season team because it isn't going to really happen now. Uh, we do get team of the season uh, Ibrahimovic though. I would definitely like to use him. There's a Tadic there, a Boo, uh, and a Naki Williams who would get us actually chemistry. But here I'm going to go for team of the season Ibra because I know how OP he is. So left mid, we could do with a Barca player, maybe. That would be pretty decent. We do get team of the season, uh, Fraser, who looks pretty decent, to be fair. I swear he was an SBC. I could be wrong there. Maybe he was, um, oh no, he probably was in the Prem team of the season. So do I go for him? I feel like I'm going to go for him. It's going to be hard to get um, some chemistry, but maybe use him as a super sub. We'll have to wait and see. Up next, we get very bad uh, centre mid. We get Granero, who I'm probably going to have to go for um, because he plays in La Liga. Uh, yep, just double checking that, and he does. So we're going to go for him just for some chem. Who do we get next? We get Iniesta OR. I love his team of the season OR. If you haven't done the SBC, I think it's a little bit too late now. He was so, so good. Um, but we get three Serie A players, which is kind of annoying. Um, I could go Bentacore to be fair, because he'll get chemistry with Suarez. So if I switch, if I do that and switch those, what? How does that give me minus chem? Who does he? Oh, he links with that sentiment. All right, we'll see what we can do. We'll see what we can do. Right, left back. Who do we get? We need someone with a bit of chemistry. We get Sandro, Viria, or however you say his name. We get Danny Rose and Delph. I feel like at this point we're just going to go for the highest rated. That could actually be the play right now. Just go for the highest rated players. I think that's what I might do because the chemistry seems to be out the window here. We get Thiago Silva. Yeah, I'm actually looking. This could be a challenge actually. Just pick the highest rated uh, players. Um, who can I go for here? I'm going to go for Lenglet because he's the joint highest and he actually gets chem with um, Jordi Alba. So we're going to do that. We're going to go for the highest rated players and we'll try to do like a, ooh, a Lala. I'm going to take him the highest rated draft team. The chemistry might be way off, but it would be very interesting to use this. We get Donnarumma, who doesn't give us any chem. I don't think any of these keepers do, to be fair. Oh, that guy does, the Benitez. But I'm gonna go for Donnarumma, because he's the highest rated. So, so far it's a, uh, it's a 92 rated squad. Let's see if we can improve on that. I need to improve that center mid position. First up, Silva. I'm gonna pick this guy. Who do we get next? Can we get like a Ronaldo? That would be incredible. We get 92 Griezmann, who will actually be very useful, and he is the highest rated, so we're going to pop him in for Ibra uh, for now, just to try and get some chem. I'll see what I'll do at the end about who, who actually makes the team or not. We get a Quintero, Pogba, Mertens, Cesc Fabregas. I think here I'm going to go for Pogba. Just I know he's not the highest rated, but he um, will be the highest rated centre midfielder we get. So I'm going to pick him, and he gets us chem, so I can do that. Two positions left in the uh, reserves. I love a Ronaldo. Oh, we get Del Piero, very useful. 
Very useful for chemistry. Who do we get next? Pulisic. We get Figo and Best. Um, I'm going to go for... I'm going to go for... We'll go for George Best there. He's higher rated. And uh, I've used him before. So how does that get me... Oh, right. It's position. Um, so I'm going to slot those two there. And now we're on to the substitutes. Can I get a Ronaldo? That would be very good if I could. We get Fred. Not too useful. Could be a sub, but he's not that great in this game. We get 95 Messi. Um, I'll go with Messi. He'll actually get me some chem. Okay, no, he won't. He'll get me a strong link with um, Suarez, but other than that, it does me pretty dirty. Here we get this guy. Um, still a few more options to get someone good, hopefully. We get Zanetti. I'll take that 100%. Who do we get next in the centre back? We get a Cooper who is 84 rated. We also get Kolarov, who I could try and use. I doubt I will though. He's not probably the quickest. Two positions left. Can we get a sick centre back? We do. We get Bobby Moore. I'll put him in, even though I don't really like using him. I feel like he's very slow, um, but I'll, he, he'll get me chemistry, and he's really high rated. And then last but not least, we get Bauman to complete the squad. So it's 91 rated. We've got tons and tons of players to fit, fit in. We actually can nearly get 100 chem. If I throw in, let's throw in you there. And we've actually got 100 chem somehow, guys. This draft started out looking so bad and we've actually managed to do a madness with this. Um, I wonder if I could put Ebra in, swap you and then swap, where's him? Oh no, that doesn't work, unfortunately. So Ebra's going to have to be a super sub, I think, guys. Which isn't, too, or which I'm not complaining about. Um, whoops, because I'm going to throw Messi and Ebra on. That they would be some deadly subs, to be fair. We've also got Ben Tacor and JJ Kocha. So I'm going to just swap him there. And then other than that, we made a. Actually, let me just see. Let me put Bauman. No, let's put. Oh, put Lenglet. Put Kolarov. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. So, I've actually managed to get a 192 with 100 chem. Who would have saw that coming with some of the selections I was giving? Um, which is, you know what, I'll take it. So, we've got a very high rated uh, draft and some players that I haven't actually used yet. Like this team of season uh, Silva, team of season Lala, Donnarumma. Um, I've used these guys, but I'm pretty familiar with them. I haven't used that Alba actually, to be fair. So, let's finish it off and add a manager. Um, who is anyone that actually needs chem? Uh, Zanetti, Best. Just all oh, Thiago Silva needs chem. So if we can get a French league, which we can't. Oh, he's Brazilian though. Okay, I'll go for you. We'll get uh, this guy. And there, as you can see, 192 rated draft. Let's get into game number one. Hopefully, I can go far with this team um, and we can get some awesome prizes and then hopefully pack a team of the season at the end of this. We'll have to find out. Let's go. Well, guys, game number one done and I seriously did not see this one coming. I actually lost in the first round. As you can see here, uh, there's a red card on my Thiago Silva. This game is... I just don't enjoy it. I genuinely just don't enjoy FIFA 19. It is so random. And I, I can't even be bothered to explain like why. I hope it just shows in the uh, in the replay some of the misses my guy's done. And then the red card, which I didn't do anything uh, about. But anyway, here's his first goal. Uh, it's a standard FIFA 19 goal. Near post corner with uh, Team of the Year uh, Ramos. He then made it 2-0 with this Team of the Season Zayek, who for some reason had a force wheel around him. I couldn't get near him. And all my players just repelled it away from him. It was ridiculous. Uh, he did a heel to heel and then just smashed it. Uh, and then the I managed to get one back with Suarez uh, with this goal. Pass it into my players. Nice little play. And then I did a uh, first time shot, which it wasn't a 180. Kind of was side on, which is okay. But still, like at no point is he looking at the goal. Um, and then I made it two all just before half time with this little break. George Best feeds in Suarez again, and then he nutmegs him uh, to make it two all. And then my Thiago Silva got sent off for this. He played a ball in. Oh, it's not even going to show it, is it? It's literally going to show the. Okay, here we go. So um, he played a pass. My um, Bobby Moore touches it, but he just puts it into his player's path, and then my keeper comes and sweeps it. I don't know what my Thiago Silva's doing, maybe blocking the path. He jumps over 
the keeper and lands on my Thiago Silva and he got a penalty for that and a red card. He then, uh, I think I saved the penalty actually and then he scored this rebound goal straight after. Uh, then I managed to make it 3 all with this goal. I cross it in, he tries to clear it, my Ibra that gets a touch and scores. And then, um, let's have a look at my, it's got some saves from my keeper, it doesn't have a save from, there was basically a point and Pogba was one on one, four yards out and he hits it uh, wide, it was ridiculous, I don't know how he missed it, but then he scores this ridiculous goal which just shouldn't be in FIFA, when do you ever see this? It never happens, I don't like, they just need to get rid of that, it's so stupid, it just, I don't, it, like, it belongs in FIFA Street, it doesn't belong in FIFA, he even handballs it there as well, but somehow manages to wrap it around three players and then puts into net which was in the 117th minute to make him go through but yeah like i said this game is just i haven't had i've had zero enjoyment playing fifa 19 if i'm going to be completely honest um but the only thing i do like is playing uh draft making new drafts and uh trying out new teams but anyway we do get a draft token so it means that in the next episode i get a free entry which is decent um but yeah that's gonna wrap up for this video guys hopefully you did enjoy it sorry it was a bit of a short one but that's fifa honestly anything can happen and when the game's against you the game is against you but i'll be back with another video very soon another draft of glory hopefully we can do a lot better than that but yeah that's gonna wrap up if you did enjoy it do smash that thumbs up subscribe if you're new to join the wolf pack but it's been your boy wolfie and i'll see you in the next video peace